hey guys welcome back to my channel i hope you guys are all doing well if this is your first time here you are welcome if you haven't subscribed to my channel click that subscribe button down there and click the bell anytime i post a new video you'll be notified today i'm gonna share with you guys the akara recipe akara is a gambian dish so the first thing i'm gonna do i'm gonna soak the bean for overnight you can do it for four hours it all works very well, but overnight help you to peel the skin easier way without using the food processor. So after the next day, what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna peel the skin. Just I'm pressing it down with my hands. You can see what I'm doing. If you do overnight, it helps a lot to peel the skin. But if you don't have time to do it overnight, you can do it um, four hours or six hours and use your food processor to make help a little bit. It's a lot of work, but it's worth it. What I'm, I'm just gonna steam is a lot of work. I'm gonna press the beans and add lots of water. And if I add the water, you will see the skins are coming off. Water helps to, to see skins. And lots of water. The more you press it, the more the skins come. And then I repeat that clean the beans, press it. Oh, you can use your modern pistol, it's very good option and it's so easier to it's help very well to peel the skin. So what I'm gonna do, add the water, rinse it, and you will see it's somewhat a little bit stubborn, <laughs> didn't want to peel. I have to use my hand, just pick those ones to take the skins off. I think it's delicious, but it's a lot of work. You can see how the skins are coming off. The more water you put, you see the skins, the more you press it. That's how you see the skins come off. Now it's almost clean. Then I'm just gonna rinse it a little bit, then I will add water and I will pick the the stolen ones, those are a little bit hard to peel this. So that's what I'm gonna, I'm gonna add the water and just show you guys what I'm gonna do. See, I'll show you guys. Can you see all the skins? We don't need them, we need to put them a bit. Uh, as you can see, I'm just gonna pick the skins and I'm gonna take those a uh, little bit hard. Skins off. Yeah, it's clean now. It's time to blend the beans. I'm just gonna add it in the food processor. You can use your blend, it's worked the same. They all work very well. Then I will add chili, habanero pepper. It depends on you how much you like spice. I don't have to be spicy. Then I add salt and I add one and a half cup of water is depend on you how you want your consistency to be like. And I blend it. It's gonna be creamy and thick. The consistency. This is um, I am happy with the consistency. Now I'm just gonna make the sauce. What I need onions, bell pepper, tomatoes and some spice and I add some bay leaf to make the sauce. You can add tomato paste if you want to, but I'm not doing that today. I'm adding some paprika and some garlic and some habanero pepper spice. Then I add some chili powder, more spice and I add soy sauce. And I add a little bit of water, let it simmer five to six minutes, then the sauce will be done. 
After five to six minutes, as you can see, the sauce is done. Now I'm just gonna put it aside, then move on to fry the upper. Now I'm just gonna use one spoon each to fry the upper. And I, as you can see, now I'm just frying them, let them cook for five minutes each side, both sides. And I flip them, let them cook another five minutes. And after five minutes, I'm just gonna take them out and I cook the second batch. I'm making a lot of akka, a lot. And you can store them in your freezer. Then, like if you fry them, you can store them in your freezer. If you need them, you just warm it in your oven or microwave. That's what I do. To make it all the time. I'm using one spoon each. This depends on you how big you want. You want the big one or small? It's how you like it. Just, yeah. Those are done now. As you can see, this is the end of the Akawa recipe. If you like this video, don't forget to give it big thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, subscribe, click that subscribe button down there. And I will catch you guys in my next video. See you guys. Bye.